Have you ever had a hard time trying to figure out if you want a cart bag or a stand bag because sometimes you may want to go for a walk? I may have found the perfect bag for you. We're going to take the Dietrack hybrid bag for a spin. Don't stop. Unlike most uh, carry bags, it does have a 14 slot divider, which includes two padded slots for your putter and your driver. Quality of the material in this bag is really top notch when you really look at it. It's all the way from the legs that have a real sturdy, don't feel cheap weight to them. The oversized pocket here is plenty big enough to fit you know, a couple of jackets in there, maybe a few extra things like a water bottles or snacks or whatever. It's definitely a good size pocket on the side there. This bag also does feature a little cooler pocket where you can probably fit, truthfully, probably about four to five cans in there with a little bit of ice if you want. Otherwise, it's going to be a little packed in there. Not the biggest cooler, but if you're carrying this bag, it's probably the perfect amount so you don't want to carry all that extra weight anyways. I just don't understand why they would put holes in the cooler that was then drained into another pocket that which then drains to the outside. Why didn't they just all consolidate it? That's definitely a swimmers. Is it does have this top lock feature on here which does allow you with other push carts it does feature this to just slide your cart in there without having to strap it and just drop it in there and go as you need. Great is that top lock feature is and I think is a great idea. Only carts I found with that feature are bag boy carts so if you were to have any other carts it's not going to work though if you do have it it is a great feature. It is just unfortunately a very limited system in selection for you. Price on this is probably what really does set this apart from a lot of other bags that I've seen and tested out is that you are able to find this on their website for $190. So I would say that's probably the best bang for your buck in the moment of any bags I've tested or seen thus far. Did like that it does have these little pockets for your pitch marker and Sharpie. Unfortunately, my pitch marker, as you see, it just doesn't fit. Mine's just a little too big, I guess. Or if you're like me and you like to play an occasional part three, maybe you just want to walk with your bag, make it a little easier, a little less hassle walking. This bag's pretty comfortable. Outside, these straps just keep sliding off my shoulders here, especially with more of those active wear shirts that are a little bit slicker. This shoulder strap just kind of fall right off, as you can see. It does also start to give my shoulder here a little fatigue, constantly holding on to this mess around, which there's a strap here. The padding for the back of this bag, definitely pretty thin. It's not exactly great, and I can imagine over time, it's really going to be pretty much non-existent at some point. Kind of a downside, otherwise it feels pretty good on my back. Uh, it feels pretty lightweight. So you can see I really did struggle trying to get these straps to fit me. I just, I just, I don't know if it's my shoulders or what. Even with weight, no weight, the straps just kind of kept sliding off. So that was a little bit of an awkward situation for me. But they are pretty oversized in padding. So maybe with time, they form fit to your shoulders a bit more. Put it over the top over most carry bags. That means you can remove these straps here, give you that more cart bag look to it, and get that out of the way when, if you are taking a golf cart. I do like on the hinges of this bag, they do turn. So when you are walking, it does kind of fit form to you. So you're not kind of like strapped in there and dead bolted in. It does have a little sway and leeway to you has a nice little feature that which also does double as the way that you remove them and you can see here how quickly and how easy it is to remove and put it back on that's just ingenious little engineering there so you may not have heard of this bag before but i definitely suggest checking it out it's a great one i'll see you guys in the next one